So my honest opinion, <laughs> so my honest opinion about this butter chicken sauce from Costco is that I know you're probably thinking why am I dressed like this? I'm dressed for the occasion because on today's episode of Rupee's Kitchen, I'm gonna be teaching you how to make butter chicken Indian style. I hope you enjoy the intro. Just wanted to make it a little different and entertaining. Uh, thank you to my little son who did, uh, he agreed. I didn't force him, he agreed to do the Indian dance. So anyways, I've chopped up some chicken into chicken cubes. I've um, chopped up some onions. Now, non bread is essential to eat with butter chicken. You can eat it with rice, but non bread is also good. Uh, there's sour cream that I like to put into the butter chicken. Now you can put also plain yogurt or you can put milk, but I like sour cream. Margarine to put on top of the naan and when you heat it up. Some lemon juice to put into the butter chicken. It gives it a nice flavor some minced garlic you can use fresh garlic as well now the reason why i'm making this video is because i found this butter chicken sauce in costco and i was really interested in trying this and making a video to see if this actually tastes the same as homemade butter chicken from scratch now a lot of times we don't have time to go through the whole recipe so this is an alternative that i wanted to use and see if this really works please watch the video till the end because I will be trying out this butter chicken and I'll give you my honest opinion. The first thing you have to do is you have to put olive oil, make sure the olive oil is nice and heated. And then after that, you just put in your onions and saute your onions. The next step we're gonna do is we're gonna put some garlic in here. I like garlic, so I'm gonna put a lot you don't have to put as much as garlic it's all up to you but me personally i just like the taste and the smell of garlic i have put the chicken and what i'm doing is i'm just mixing it with the sauteed onions and the garlic so while the chicken is getting made this is where you would put lemon juice i've already put lemon juice um just forgot to videotape it but the lemon juice and the garlic, what it does, it just gives the chicken a nice uh, flavor and smell. Lemon juice and garlic combined in meat is actually pretty good. Okay, so this butter chicken actually smells like real butter chicken. Like it really legit smells like real butter chicken. So I'm kind of getting excited now, hoping that it tastes good too so it's like basically the whole jar that i'm putting in here and whatever's left and what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna put a little bit of water in here because butter chicken should be a little saucy okay so i really have to admit and say that this legit smells and looks like homemade butter chicken so so far i'm pretty impressed i gotta say Look at the color. I've added sour cream and honestly, it's uh, looking really good. So literally, literally what I did is I got a non bread and I put margarine over this with a butter knife. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to flip it on the frying pan and cook this on both sides. So it's, you don't have to put margarine or butter on your non bread, but I just find that once again, it gives it that nice, crispy um, texture and flavor. Look at that. That looks good. This with butter chicken. Mm -mm -mm. So here you have it. This is the end result, the butter chicken. And what I did is I put some cilantro on top in non bread. Looks yummy. So my honest opinion about this butter chicken sauce is that it's not bad if you're looking for a quick fix. Um, the price is not bad, the taste is okay, but for me, I feel like it wasn't spicy enough and it just, 
the flavor wasn't all there. So if you're looking for extra flavor, you can still use this sauce and just add some uh, flavors to it. But other than that, I think the butter chicken sauce was uh, overall, it was not bad. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to my video and let me know if there's anything else that you would like me to try. And uh, yeah, oh, I will so try it. Thank you.